And uh, what, what have we accomplished? It's nice to have money sitting in coffers in Washington, but I don't have people working on, the, on Main Street. Mr. Hanna, did you want to make a... No, I think everyone here uh, fully recognizes the value of this bill. $35 billion has the potential to create between 25 and 40,000 jobs per billion. Everyone would like more money. It simply isn't there. Well, and two, um, was it Cortland? We had a, yes. we had a couple there that uh, had a small business. Uh, God bless that lady who came to the hearing. I don't remember her name. But she, they had a small, uh, I think it was a trucking business. And she sat there just as deadpan as could be, and she had sat down and totaled all the requirements and things she had to do, the licenses, the forms, the, all uh, of the things that she had to do. And I think she and her husband had one or two trucks. Uh, two trucks, and she had trucks. a full-time job. And, and she had a full-time job. And then when she got through with that, she detailed, uh, she detailed the taxes that they paid. Uh, and uh, you, the average person never think of it, you know, she went through the uh, tire tax and the, uh, um, the excise tax and all, I mean, all of the different taxes, the extra taxes that they paid on fuel. But uh, I thought that was some of the best testimony I ever heard for trying to streamline the process and, um, and uh, do a little right, bit more. It was more. Uh, Bill and Cindy Clem. Okay, great, great folks. Okay, let's keep.